<laughs> this has kept going already. Are you? Were you here to dance or what? Uh, yeah, I'm, I'm working on my dance moves, man. <laughs> so you were out here today to support Art and Soul? Yes, Art and Soul and um, the woman who puts this uh, charity event on. I come every year and she's awesome. And it's, it's green is awesome, eco-friendly is awesome. So, you know, every year. So have you, you've gone green then, obviously? I, well, I've gone green, like, uh, with plastics at home, um, with, yeah, I mean, you know, in a, sim in a simple, you know, a, a simplistic way, yes. I mean, I'm not, like, hardcore green, but I do as much as I can, you know, with the car, with the saving gas, with the emissions, um, and, and, you know, plastics also. And uh, I try, I mean, you know. And you were also taking part in the Art and Soul photo shoot? Yeah, I love, I love these. He's awesome, man. This guy's awesome. Um, Brian so, Smith, the photographer? Yeah, Brian. Brian's wonderful. From Miami Beach, Florida. Um, you know, uh, yeah, Art and Soul. I mean, uh, for me, you know, like acting is, is pretty much, you know, turned my life into a purpose and give, just like connected me with people and kind of the world as a whole. And it's, it's, it's made me a lot more compassionate for, you know, people, cultures, awareness. And um, if that's part of what they're trying to accomplish it's just right down the right um alley so do you think arts tend to get the short end of the stick in america <clears throat> I, I i i don't think so personally no i mean um no i mean it seems like the arts i i, I you know maybe in school systems you know like high schools and things like that there's never any budgets to, to do that in certain areas but i mean the arts as a whole like on on our level seems like it brings so much awareness that i think you know, everyone watches, you know, movies and TVs and they get sucked so into that that if you got a, a, a message to put across to people, I think the arts is an amazing way to, you know, be able to get in that venue where you can say what you feel, you know. Well, speaking of, of TV, uh, how's the show going? The show's awesome. We're, uh, let me see, we're on our like uh, 15th episode of 18, you know, and, and, and Holly's up for an Emmy this weekend, so hopefully she'll win. And it's been amazing, man. It's been an amazing journey and yeah. Can't. What's it like working with Holly? What's that? So Holly's pretty cool to work with. It's amazing, yeah, dude. It's been you know for three years now of uh, she's an incredibly open soul, and and when she acts, she is the most present, uh, committed actress I've ever worked with ever. So it's it's been an amazing journey for me. Yeah, yeah. Well, since I interrupted your dance routine at the beginning, do you have any more dance moves for us as we? Uh... <laughs> I do it for my, I just have a four and a half month old girl. Oh, okay. So I have to entertain her, so I sit in front of her and I try every possible thing. Well, well, what one's entertainer? Um, the, the bigger I get and the goofier and come in. <laughs> Is this what you were doing in the photo shoot or these are the poses I don't you were seeing? I did over there, dude. I don't remember that far back. <laughs> well, thank you very much, Kenny Johnson. I appreciate it. That was great. Take thank care. You.